And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box by Lee Dixon. And live football coming up from the Dutch Eredivisie. It's VVV Venlo facing AZ. Yeah, Derek, cracking atmosphere as usual here. That will lead to a nervy, energetic start. Frenetic, fast play to begin with before it all settles down. I'm really looking forward to this one. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man. Lee, what are you anticipating seeing from him? Well, forget about his presence on the pitch and what he can do on there. His presence in the tunnel is fearful enough. Players will be looking at him and they know how strong he is. When he gets out on the pitch, he really, really commands his space. So the initial 11 for the home side. We're thinking 4-3-3. Yeah, one central striker, Derek. The width comes from the wingers who will stay high and wide. A very narrow midfield and a conventional back four. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. The tactical battle is going to be highly instructive. 4-3-3 on one side and 4-3-3 on the other, Lee. Well, when you match systems up, it's all about individuals. Who can get the better of the player you're playing against? And in this formation, certainly the wingers are going to be key on either side. And the lone striker, when the balls come in the box, he needs some support from one of those three midfield players making runs into the penalty area. Gelmi. Bajonic has it. Jorios Yakumakis. Mashash. Post. Yakumakis. They really look after the ball when they have it. Jorios Yakumakis. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Mitsu. Can they create something from here? I just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. Post. Jorios Yakumakis. Zinedine Mashash. Dangerous looking attack. Well, they keep working away, looking for an opening. Being pressed and pressed high. Myron Boadu. Untidy on the ball. Post. Donis. Well, not hard to read that pass. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Useful looking ball. And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward.
Well, here's the Dennis, a great ball to put him through, and he composes himself, coolly slides it past a lonely keeper, who will be asking questions about where his back four went to. The opening goal of the game then. Guvara. The hosts have had the lion's share of possession, but after that it's been really disappointing. Players are looking at each other. You've got to take control, you've got to take responsibility yourself. Make something happen in this game. Mitsu. Boadu. Well dealt with that ball comfortably. Great opportunity. What can he do from here? Weindau. It's with Carlson. Can he take the chance? It's got to be. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. He's driven in the corner. It might be. Can he put it away? Excellent defending, but the chance is still on. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, you're right, he has played well and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch in this form. Sit back and enjoy him in the second half. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Good work to regain possession. Post. Zinedine Mashash. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. Mashash. Yorios Yakumakis. And he's made headway. Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. And they're making a change. And over comes the corner. It had an invitation attached, but he couldn't avail himself of the opportunity. Well, just look at him. He thinks he's in just wide. Anastasdonis. Donis. 
It might be on for them. Donny Snar. Zinedine Mashash. Post. Well read to ease the pressure. As you can see, the visitors haven't had too much of the ball. But again, we've seen it before. We'll see it again. Their counter-attack play has been absolutely fantastic. Pace really hurts defences, and they've got that in abundance. Donis. Van Krooy. Oh, good use of the ball. Did look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Myron Boadu. Cup Mainers. Mitsu. Bruno Martins Indy. Not a great pass. Anastasios Donis. Donis. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Mitsu. Now can they counter clinically? Well, that's one for them to pursue. Well, not to be in terms of the counter-attack. Leon Guvara. A bit of running room now on the wing. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. Now they've lost it. Calvin Stings. Cup Mainers. Myron Boadu. Mitsu. And that's an important intervention. Well, there's a saying in football, Derek, that you always get one more chance. They need that chance right now. The fans feel it might be coming too. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Cup Mainers. Myron Boadu. Chance to cross. This looks promising. Now Mitsu. Donis. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, there's no doubt they'll be disappointed. No points gained today, and that will hurt a little bit. I think the manager knows they weren't quite right today. They need to regroup and go again. And I think it's accurate to say, Lee, that this man was the light bringer for his side. Well, he's always a danger, isn't he? No more so when he grabbed that goal. He never disappoints me when I watch him. He's just too good, simple.